Hello guys. Today we are going to explain you. What study skills is? Key term study skills is a broad term that applies to tools and strategies used to make learning more efficient, organized, and successful. Techniques used for organizing study time, methods used for assimilating the information, and test preparation can be included within the purview of study skills. Some people, for example, study better in groups, while others prefer to study alone. There are a number of different ways in which a person may learn information. Two of the most common learning styles are visual and auditory. Visual learners pick up items that they can see the easiest, while auditory learners absorb more by hearing the information. For those who learn best by visual cues, flashcards and videos may be helpful in addition to taking notes and rereading them. Auditory learners may wish to take record lectures and rereading them. Auditory learners may wish to take record lectures and play them back during study sessions. Study skills are not from other world. Use it. Hey Vincent, could you explain me that thing about study skills? Yeah Marisol, so tell me one thing, what is your technique to organize your study time? Uh, my what? I don't organize my study time. That is necessary? Yeah, it is, come on. Join with my study group and we show you how to do it. Okay, I'll be there. Hi, Karina. Hello, Marisol. Are you coming to the party tonight? But it's Wednesday. So? I need some time to organize my portfolio. So no. The portfolio is for Friday. We can do it later. No, thanks. So please give some space. I have to study. What are you doing? I'm drawing a mind map. For what? I'm trying to understand the class of teacher Luisa. You know, the self-efficacy and the call cycle. I already learned. Well, for me it's easier, so I practice with visual things. Okay, can I practice with you? No. <laughs> sure, I'm just kidding. Ozil. Where are you going? Oh no. Meet Jessica. Jessica is worried about her upcoming exams, but thanks to a recent workshop she attended on exam strategies, she's going to conquer her anxiety and ace her final exams. Jessica has been pretty good about attending her lectures, taking good notes, and catching up on all her course readings. In her workshop, Jessica learned to ask what material she'll be tested on and how the exam is structured so she can study appropriately. Jessica starts by taking an inventory of all her notes. That's when she remembers that she missed a week of lectures when she was sick. Jessica asks her friend Liz, who's in the same class, to share her notes for the week she missed. She also sets a regular schedule for studying. She makes sure she doesn't change her dietary habit, especially with sugar and caffeine. She still enjoys a morning coffee. She also still goes out for a run every day and doesn't ignore her workouts during the exam period she still goes to bed at regular hours. 
Jessica knows that keeping her body well rested will keep her mind stay focused for the exam. Jessica makes a five-day study plan for each of her exams. That means she develops a list of all the materials she's being tested on, divides it across four days, allocates a block of time to study a new section each day, and compiles an abbreviated set of notes while she reviews. On the fifth day, she focuses on reviewing the core notes that she compiled. Jessica is ready for her exam. Are you? For more information on exam strategies and time management, visit the Learning Commons Study Toolkits or attend one of our online workshops.